everyone, welcome back to Show Me How to Win. We're at Gen Con 2018 and we're at Flying Frogs Booth checking out Shadow of Brimstone. I've heard of this game for a long time and I've never tried it. Next to me is Jason Hill. He is the designer of this game. So I'm going to ask him how to win at Shadow of Brimstone fully co-op game as a beginner. So basically I would say that one of, the, one of the biggest things that a lot of people do is they'll go too slow. They'll bottleneck and keep the team really close together and that makes it a lot safer for them against monsters, but it gives the darkness a lot more opportunities to escape and to get further up the track. And it, it can be really dangerous because the longer you, uh, you take, the more likely it is the darkness is to escape and uh, you lose the mission. So are you suggesting us to just rush it and split up? Uh, maybe not split up across different pathways or look through too Never, <laughs> never, ever split up. It's a little dangerous. Yeah, you probably don't want to look down too many doorways at once. But, you know, you don't necessarily need to play it too safe and stay bottlenecked at the door. You can rush into a room, spread out, fight the enemies, try to kill them as quickly as you can so that the darkness does not uh, get to advance on the track so much faster by you taking so long. One more question. Is there a particular gear or card that's really good that if you see it, you don't want to pass up? Um, there's a couple that are pretty cool. Uh, and there's lots of cool stuff in, you can find down in the mines. One of them that's pretty, uh, pretty cool is the trusty pistol. If you find that gear, it lets you use uh, your agility skill as the number of shots that you get. So it can be a pretty powerful card, especially if you find other things that can increase your agility. Okay, so if you're a character with high agility, make sure you, if you see the trusty pistol, get it. Can you share items between well, players? Yeah, yeah, you can uh, pass items back and forth. So if you have low agility, pass that trusty pistol to your high agility player, yeah. right? <laughs> I think definitely so. Okay. Thank you so much, Jason, for showing us how to win at Shadow Brimstone. Looking forward to trying this game. I've heard about it for a long time. Finally, I have a good strategy tip on how to play and how to win. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!